you do understand. <laughs> <laughs> How do we get double chin? Ready? This is Austin. Because he can't make a double chin, and I'm like. <laughs> Hello. Your room has the worst lighting ever. Yeah, it also stinks. What? Just kidding, I like my room smell. <laughs> smell like, um, hazelnut. <laughs> Just kidding. I can't get this choke roll. Choker's the choke. Ha ha ha. Guess what we should be doing? Hmm. Let's go through your clothes. Right now? No. I'm too tired. Gosh. No way. We're not going through your clothes right now. Um... Today was the worst day at work, but I was home. It was. I was listening to her calls, and everybody kept hanging up on her. They were so rude. Or they called and were looking for a different storage company, and she was like, <laughs> They weren't looking for a different one. It's just that we're so good that we're sold out. And so then people are like, but I need it. I'm like, sorry, man. You should have called sooner. Because everybody's getting ready for the summer. Well, the students are going into back home and putting their stuff into storage so they can go back home <sighs> anyways um what's the deal Amberly's silly <sighs> we have no potential of a place to stay yet I'm kind of stressed out about it gonna be homeless <laughs> gonna be homeless getting food and we have to be out of here by like the first part of June that's in like three weeks and we have no prospects yet. Okay. I can't find anything. Everything is like, well, I did find a place I thought it was potential. And then they're like, our three bedroom is up on the fourth floor. And I'm like, okay, honestly, you're going to have to stop being picky. I am not hiking three, three flights, four That's flights of stairs. Elevators. They don't have elevators. They should have okay, elevators. Okay, Emberly's carrying her dresser up four flights of stairs. I can't even carry you. <laughs> Point. Remember at Walmart? <laughs> You're so freaking loud. Dad is going to bed. Jake is going to sleep. Shh. Susan. 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 You're so weird. All right. So. Oh, guess what? It's my birthday. Austin is getting me a gallon of glue. Uh, yeah. She, Austin, at text and was like, hey, what does Emberly want for her birthday? And Emberly was like, I want some glue. I want a gallon of glue in a five-gallon bucket. <laughs> I want some shaving cream. <laughs> She's like all into wanting to make this slime. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. I'm making a giant batch. All right. You got to tell a secret. Tell a secret. Secret time. I just got grounded from my phone. She did just get grounded from her phone. I still love you. <laughs> Gross. Anyways. <gasps> what? Me and Sarah were walking home. <gasps> Let's talk about what they said at your young You scared thing. me. <laughs> <laughs> they were talking about mental, mental illness. illness. And they, she's, what did you say earlier about it? You came home? So, it's so weird. So, you know how Curtis has like a ton of mental illnesses and crap. I actually know what's like to go through the crap of mental illnesses and like witnessing people that have mental illnesses I guess you could say that um and these people it was like a counselor from my old school and the young women's stake leader or something and they were like sugarcoating what a mental illness is when they're so they were like doing this presentation thing sugar coating what does sugar coating mean to you illnesses. what does that mean they weren't telling the truth about what it actually is what they were mean? like, they were like, oh, we know we don't know everything in the beginning. They're like, disclaimer, depression, anxiety, schizophrenia. No, no. Why would we talk the about only schizophrenia? The thing they talked about was depression, anxiety, depression. They said so. Basically, depression. They were like, depression is something a blessing that God God gives you. Depression is a privilege. I was like, depression is a privilege. Are you I was like, sick right I was like, now? Felicia. Susan, what do you think you're talking about over here? Depression is, is a, a blessing. blessing. 
It's a privilege to have because God gave it to you. God gave me and depression and anxiety. Huh. And it was a blessing. <laughs> did they really know. say that? Yeah. Like, what did you think when they were saying that? I was like sitting there and I was like, okay, first of all, we are like, oh, hello. We are 12, 13, 14, and 15. Do you think we would know what depression and anxiety really is? Like, you, you don't. Do not... That's why they're sugarcoating it to put it in your head that it's not that big of a deal and to deal with it. That's oh, what they're trying to tell like, you. If you feel like you have any of these symptoms, talk to your parents because parents usually think it's just because you're being a teenager, but sometimes it can be you're a teenager with depression. And, I was and like, now it's okay. not okay to have it because now like, it's a okay, big deal. So talk all, to your parents. Most parents are just going to use, like, not use the excuse, but, like, think it's still them being a teenager, like, developing, growing. Their hormones are, like, kicking and then crap. And so I was like, not all parents are easy like that. And, like... Are your parents about. easy like that? Not really. If I were to tell you that I feel like I had depression, you'd be like, no, you're just growing. You're just... You're, oh, that's your sad. Are just, Do you really just have you depression? A teenager. Do you have depression? I don't know. You think you do? Do I look like I have depression? Look at my eyes. Closer. <laughs> <laughs> it's pr it is in your genes though. Evie, stop Did you know that? My bed. I have Forget depression bone. and anxiety. It runs heavy in my family. It's not a shocker if you did. I don't know if I have it, honestly. You probably do. I should get blood work done. It's I don't know if it's a blood work thing. It's a pay attention to your body thing. And your emotions and how you feel and but there are um they were like well teenagers usually have a lot of off days so and like this is really true so if you're having a lot of off days and that's going on for like more than two or a week or two then you should definitely like contact like get in touch with your not in touch but like tell your parents and get um professional help if you're do you like, think you have true, more off but, days you do? Yeah. Oh. I wonder how much of that is behavioral. Yeah, yeah, I kind of just like, wanted to crawl up in my bed and cry. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Well, no matter what, you can talk to me and dad about stuff. <laughs> Let's call the 1 800 number. Just kidding. Um, look at her face. I don't call 1-800-DEPRESSION numbers. Actually, we can... Scams. <laughs> no, they're not. Um, but there are, like, we can get a hold of our insurance, and we can get you an appointment, and they can get you on some meds if you need to. True story. Anyways, I think it's interesting. There must be an issue with girls in the church in our boundaries, because they have wouldn't have talked about it. You like... Hmm? Because you don't watch stories on Instagram, right? No, but I hear all about them. And you don't really, like, usually scroll through Instagram a lot. You usually do face to Facebook, which not a lot of teenagers have. I have Snapchat. I have Instagram. I know you do, but, I like, have those so I can watch what's going on. But, like, you follow mostly adults. I don't, don't like the people that I follow. You should see. Um, my friend posted a picture, like, a day or two ago. And he was like, in the caption, he was like, KMS, which means kill myself, which is like, like. Are you serious? Yeah. But like, I don't think he really actually meant it because a lot of people. Well, these kids, a lot of times are like, they say things too, and they don't mean what they say. Because they say like. Oh, they in, think it's like a text, trend thing to say. In text, you're like, W-Y-D for what are you doing? Like the yeah. short, because people are getting lazy. Um, people are getting lazy. But like, people like to get attention. They don't like to say that they want attention. So they just Oops, say, she's getting attention. attention. She's <laughs> like, give me attention. She's an attention hog. <laughs> um, but his caption said, kill myself. And I was like. Did you say something? Yeah. I was like, are you okay? And then I was like, this picture is lit. Because it's kind of hot. Um, <laughs> but I looked at the comments and they're like, yeah, good idea. Let's go drink bleach together. And. Like, there's so many what kids that, like, crap? I feel like they have depression, and, like, you should, like... They uh, joke around about it we should to make light of it. We should switch Instagram accounts for a day. Yeah, because we should. Dude, you, the things people post, you get oh. mad at me because, like, I'm scrolling through Instagram, and you I see... I don't get mad at you. And you see something, like, 
Um, no, I get mad when she starts talking to people she doesn't know. Oh, like that's what I get mad at. Slime yeah, things. so she likes these slime things, and she's like, "Hey, can I have your slime?" I'm like, "Do you even know them? You don't even know them. Don't do that." Yeah, but, but yes, I think you're onto something. We should trade Instagrams we for should. a day. That'd be a cool video. I think we should do that. We should change. We're Instagram. going to change Instagram and Snapchat. Yeah, not Snapchat. I cannot. No, I cannot let you have my Snapchat because my Snapchat is my life. That's going away and we're trading. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, here's the deal. You know how you got grounded from your phone? Yeah. If you want your phone back, we have to trade Snapchats, Instagrams. Anything else that she thinks is awesome? What other one is there? Those are the two that she's obsessed with. Oh, music please. No, not music please. Yeah. Please, not music we're trading those three. If you want your phone back. That has to happen for 24 hours. 24 hours. We're trading Instagram. I logged into four Snapchat, accounts on Instagram. Musically. Did you know I have four accounts on Instagram on? Well, I get them all. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I logged into yours, Sarah's, Zaley, and me. Yeah, well, I get Amberly's, Zaley's, Musically's, I'm Snapchat. Out of Sarah's. <laughs> so, are you up for the deal? And you have to log out of yours. You can't be on your own account. Okay. You have to. Why did I even tell you about this? Yes. <laughs> turkey. <laughs> you go like this. So, you know how like a turkey like... Yes. Go, 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 go. Teach. So, instead of like going like this, you go, turkey. Or you go, you go Wait, you gotta turkey. turn it sideways so we can turkey. see. Go, turkey. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Baby, where are you going? That's funny. Come okay. Back. So, Emberly is going to get her oh, phone no. back tomorrow on those stipulations. Are you excited? Stay lime and awesome, guys.